Thank you for joining us to learn more about the auto email app for Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central, developed by Semcrest. The auto email app will let you automatically email sales and purchase documents to customers and vendors with little or no effort. With one click, you can send a collection email that includes a statement and all supporting documents, or you can remind your customers if they have a short paid or non-paid invoice. You can also have the app automatically send an invoice or credit memo at the time you post it, or schedule a monthly statement to all customers, all without any user interaction. You can review an email log to see when the emails were sent and by whom. You can save hours every day having auto email do the hard work of collecting documents, writing email bodies, emailing, and storing evidence that the emails were sent, making your team more productive and more efficient. The sales and purchase documents that can be emailed are sales quotes, orders, return orders with invoices and credit memos being able to be sent at the click of a button or sent automatically at the time of posting along with purchase orders. Let's now look at a few examples of how this app works. So here we are in Business Central looking at a datum corporation sales order. He just called in. He wanted to place an order for a Mexico swivel chair and an Amsterdam lamp. So we've created the order. He wants to check it out. We go up here click on email order, document queued for emailing, one click, it's done. On the customer card here for Trey Research and they needed information on a posted sales invoice so we're going to go over, get the posted sales invoice, they had a question about 103215 so we're going to go into the invoice and we are going to email the invoice over to them. One click, it's done. Some of the specialty emails that we have are on the posted invoices for short paid or non-paid invoices. Statements, which can be on demand and or automatically sent at a scheduled time. Or collections, which is going to be a statement with all of the past due documents all collected into a single email. Here we are back on the posted sales invoices for Trey Research. And as you can see from the highlighted invoice, it is past due and there is also a short paid on that. So what we're going to do is click on the short paid notice and email that over to them. And that is different than just the email invoice in that it is a different body text that is done in the setups. Back here on the customer card for Trey Research, and we notice that they do have an overdue balance and so we could email them a statement. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're actually going to email them a collection, which is going to be the statement with all the company documents that are overdue. And so you don't have to create that manually anymore and collect all that information. It's going to be done with the click of a button. So here we are in the Outlook 365 client, and we've got the four emails that were sent to me by the system. And so we're going to go into the sales order that a datum corporation had that is for the Amsterdam lamp and the Mexico swivel black chair. Now let's go into the sales invoice from Trey Research. As you can see here in the body of the text, it says, please find the invoice. And then Trey Research also had a short paid invoice. And you notice that the text is a little bit different in the body. That's because that's set up in the auto email setup. And so now let's go into the fourth email for Trey Research that had the customer statement. And you notice there is the statement. And then if you wanted to look at the additional invoices that were attached of the overdue invoices, here they are. Don't forget to stay connected with us. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on Twitter. Find us on LinkedIn. Go to our website. Give us a call. Email us or check out our blog. We look forward to talking with you. Have a great day.